Hello everyone, Analytics Sage. Uh, people ask me about PayPal and is it good to buy it or not. Uh, I will explain what I like and what I don't like about this chart. PayPal is one of the charts I have in my blue list, which are the stocks that I like most. But there are a couple of things about PayPal that kind of holds me back. And if I want to trade this, I need to see some more stronger evidence to buy this chart. So it looks like that paypal has finished the impulse pattern of a bigger degree so this is how i counted one two one two then wave three which is five wave pattern wave four and the wave five so this structure is finished the market should drop because this is a wave one of a bigger degree usually we drop between 50 and 60 percent which happened and i was expecting to see some resistance here when i published the initial idea on my discord channel this was possibly the area i was looking for uh, but what i don't like about this chart currently if anybody thinks to buy paypal keep in mind this level must and i write it bold must get touched not break because this is a wave four of a previous degree and it's essential if this level doesn't get touched there is always a chance that this is an x wave and the market goes down more so wait for that usually when we get here we will see a strong pullback so there is no point in rushing to buy this the second thing i don't like about this is that this looks like a very strong impulsive move and also the volume is also strong so if i want to judge this chart i think that possibly we are forming some sort of b wave and paypal might see another c wave down where is this gonna end i'm not sure but this looks like we are going to form a zigzag abc this is too sharp to be just a end of the correction wave and also i'm seeing this chart in a bigger picture so if this is a wave one of a bigger degree and if we think this is over for whatever reason if the market is gonna make the wave three in long term the targets for the wave three can also go somewhere near 3000 it's a logarithmic space okay so if this is a wave three it has a space even to get to this level but the big question is that is this actually a wave two or is it just a part of a wave two so is this a wave two or or this is just an a wave possibly a b wave and a c wave so we should wait and see keep paypal in mind but i'm not a fan of trading this very quickly because of the reasons i explained also if you have a look at the moving averages moving averages are kind of turning which is a good side the market is closing above the uh, above the moving averages so in shorter term what i will do i will wait for this level to get touched then i will come and examine this wave if this is impulsive i will wait for a pullback and then i will buy the breakout thanks for watching and have a good night